were taught to think big and not be small minded, but one local school is kind of giving us a lesson in the opposite approach as we do our WCPO Insider Report. We're going to take a look at Roger Bacon High School's success. Right now, Bob Driehaus, the education reporter from WCPO.com, is here to tell us all about it. And, and Bob, we were saying this, it's basically addition by subtraction. Tell us what Roger Bacon's doing. Right, so Roger Bacon in its heyday, maybe back in the 70s, had 1,200 boys. Uh, since then, uh, demographic, demographics have changed. They've merged into another school, and enrollment had been going down. And instead of trying to recapture their glory days, they made a decision to actually cap enrollment, which has uh, uh, enabled them to right size, mm -hmm. uh, get a balanced budget, and start putting donations into upgrading the experience for the students. So uh, better education by making it smaller. You were saying that they were having to use donations for things like copy paper? Yeah, yeah, that's right. So um, now rather than doing that, they've actually been able to create a new multi-purpose theater, conference mm -hmm. center, renovate their gym, uh, upgrade their Hall of Fame, uh, and they've got lots more plans in store. And so uh, looking forward, and you were at the school uh, just this week talking about it, what are their plans for the future with all these new improvements coming their way? So um, they they are looking to really thrive. Uh, they, they're getting more than double the applicants uh, as uh, kids that they're admitting, mm -hmm. so boys and girls, uh, and they're really able to um, customize their, their uh, enrollment to make sure they're not necessarily the kids with the highest grades, mm -hmm. but ones with a work ethic who get along with others and uh, just fit into the mold of, of Roger Bacon. That's interesting that uh, academics aren't the only barometer yeah, that they're definitely. judged by. Mm -hmm. It's really interesting. If you want to read more of Bob's article, you can do so. WCPO.com and learn more about Roger Bacon's success. Bob, thanks for coming in. Thanks a lot.